Hello everyone, welcome to the channel TopGate. In this video, I'll discuss one more problem of designing of DFA. So the problem says that we have to design a DFA that accepts all strings that start with A but not ending with B and over the alphabet A comma B. So in the previous lecture, we have seen the designing of DFA that accepts all the strings that start with A and they end with B. But in this one, we have to see that the strings should not end with B. They should start with A, but they should not end in B. Okay. So uh, before designing the DFA for this one, we'll first see uh, what is the language that we have in this uh, DFA and what is the shortest possible strings that can be generated with this uh, particular DFA. So first of all, the language that we have in this one is it says that we have to design a DFA that accepts all strings that start with with a and they should not end with B. So the shortest possible string in this case will be A. Why? Because A it starts with A as well as it is not ending with B. So the shortest possible string that we can have in this DFA is A. Okay. Uh, apart from this one, we can have A A also. Why? Because this string starts with A and it is not ending with B as well as we can have A, 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 A and so on. So all these strings must be generated by the DFA that we are going to design right now. Clear? Apart from this, what else we can have in this one? The string should start with A and it should end with A. So I am ending it with A and in between I can have any combination of A or B. So we can have B also here or we can have A, A, B, A also. We can have A, B, A, B, A, A and so on. So uh, the only thing is the only concern is that the string should start with A. It should also end with A and in between we can have any character. We can have uh, any combination of A or B. Clear? So let's design the DFA for this one. So first of all, we'll design a DFA for the shortest possible string and then we'll incorporate all the other strings in that DFA. Clear? So We'll start with some initial states, say Q0, Q0 is our initial state and we have to accept all the strings that start with A. So we'll make one more state, make this state as final and add a transition of A from Q0 to Q1. So we can see in this one that this DFA is generating a string in this case. This is the shortest possible string for this particular DFA. Now, apart from this one, this DFA should also generate all the other possibilities. That is, it can have A, A also. It can have triple A, double A, four A's also. So for that purpose, what we can have is we can add a self loop here. Okay. So this will generate A, 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 A and so on. Clear? Now, apart from this, if we have to generate, suppose A, B, A also. So then what we can do? So we have A already here and now we have to give some transition of B on this Q1. Okay. So what uh, options that we, we can have in this one? The first option that we can have is we can either add a transition of this one from Q1 to Q0 with B or we can take one more state say Q2 and add a transition of B here. So let's see which one is correct. So if we add suppose this one, so A, B, A. So it is accepting A, B, A, but suppose we have A, B, B, A. Then what we'll do? We'll do A, B and then add a self loop here of B and then A. But if we add a self loop here, then that will be starting to generate all the strings that start with B also. That's why we cannot have this transition of B on this Q1. Hence, we'll add this transition of B here. So for A, B, A, we have A, we have B, and now we can add a transition of A here. So it is generating A, B, A now, clear? Now, apart from this, if we have to generate A, B, B, A, then what we can do? We can add a self loop here, this. So A, B, B, and A. Clear? Now, suppose we want to generate uh, A, B, A, B, A, B, A. So let's see whether we can uh, generate this one from this uh, DFA or not. So we have this A, then B, then A, then B, then A, then B, and then finally 
a so it is generating all the strings that start with a and that end with a also that is not ending with b now apart from this uh, we know that uh, in dfa every state must have exactly two outgoing edges for every input alphabet so if we see this q naught on this q naught we have only one outgoing edge for a but we don't have a edge for b clear so what we can do is we can add one more state here say q3 and add a transition of b here and this q3 will act as a dead state why because if i add any transition from q3 to either q1 or q2 then that will start to generate all the strings that start with b also that's why we are making this q3 as a dead state that is there is no reachability from q3 to the final state clear so q0 is complete we have two edges one for a one for b for q3 again we need to add two edges we can add a self loop here a comma b so q3 is complete come to q1 for q1 we have one edge of a one edge of b is complete for q2 we have one edge of b one edge of a q2 is also complete so this is the dfa for the strings that start with a but not ending with b thank you so much